Listen, 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 my friend, my friend, and I have another message for you, okay? My friend, you see, they don't believe that you have changed, okay? They don't believe it. They look at you as if you are this person who is faking it all the way through. But you have went and pray and you have did the inner work you are literally trying your best to stay focused you see my friend they don't believe you changed because all they know is the old you okay they know the you that you were when you were with them they don't know the you that you have became now so they want to hold the old you against you okay and i'm here to tell you my friend it is true it is true people can change okay right now my friend i'm here to tell you that people do not believe that you have changed you have been working so hard to try to do better and although you may not fully be there yet you're getting closer and closer and closer each day you see my friend my friend they don't believe you changed because they haven't changed okay they are still finding it hard trying to work on themselves okay they are still trying to figure out how to put the pieces back together okay and they are having it really hard right now despite everything that has happened in your life or they life or whoever it could be it's not easy, okay? We all have to go through a process and try to fix and go within, get off into the root of it and figure out what is causing me to act this way. Why am I doing this? Why am I doing that? Is it that I'm not happy? Is it that it's just everybody's just making me upset or what am I doing wrong? You know, you have did the work. You were trying to get to the root of everything. And now that you are slowly becoming the person you want to become and you are finding yourself again, you are realizing that you are changing and you have seen that these people don't believe that you have changed or believe that you are trying to do something better with your life because they haven't changed. They are still living in their old ways and you are stepping out of your old ways into the new, my friend, my friend. You see, my friend, people don't believe you changed because they believe in the old saying, fake it till you make it. But nothing about you is fake, my friend. You have been keeping it real since day one. And everybody that has came across you, I guarantee you, they have told you in your face that you real. Like, there ain't too many people like you. I've gotten it, and I know you have gotten it too. And you try your best to be your most authentic self. You try your best to just keep it as real as it gets. And over here, this is as real as it gets, my friend. And it's to the point where they either like you or don't, okay? Because you were not meant to be liked by everybody. There are people that don't like me, okay? There are people that don't like me that could care less about me. And, and I could care less about them, okay? Because it's not about them. It's about me. This is my story. And this is how I choose to live out my story and to do the things that I enjoy, that I love, okay? And this is why they don't believe that you changed because they were seeing that you are stepping into your highest self. You are becoming the greatest version of yourself. And they are scared, my friend. They didn't think this day would come. Everybody right now that knows you and may not even know you they're like, how are you doing this? Who are you? Like, this is not the person that I knew. They are literally seriously trying to figure you out, my friend. You see, my friend, they don't believe you changed because, like I said, they still haven't changed. Everything about them is the same. While you're sitting over here improving, they are sitting over here stuck. And it is what it is, okay? And, and you can't help that you are choosing to move forward in your life you know a lot of people are staying stuck because they have no vision they can't see and 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 while you're doing your praying and asking god to lead you to guide you to show you the way to remove the veil okay he is doing just that in your life and he is giving you the vision so that way you are able to walk and to stand strong and firm and to stay planted okay so that way you are able to 
know what is going on and how to maneuver and get through these challenges and these tests in your life, my friend. My friend, listen, listen, listen. They don't believe you changed because they know all your secrets. They know your personal problems. They know everything that you told them and everything that you talked about, they knew, okay? And even though it, you was not trying to share all of that personal and deep stuff with them, this is still just something that they know about you. And this is why they don't believe you change. It can become your reality, okay? God is, like I said, shaping you, molding you, transforming you, renewing you. God will create you. God will make you over again, my friend. You see, my friend, they don't believe that you have changed because nothing in their life is working out for them. Everything is still the same. There is no movement. There, there is no type of movement, no type of motion, nothing. Everything is just stuck right now for them. And what you're doing is you're not laughing at their downfall or nothing. You are literally praying for these people. You are literally praying for your enemies, okay? Despite of what happened or whatever, the situation, however it ended, you literally genuinely still love these people to this day, but they don't believe that people can change. They don't believe that, you know, you're able to do better and become better, and that is what you're doing, okay? And a lot of people have tried to be like super, super childish around you, and see you, you are very mature and you matured at an early age. I sit see that because I was like that as well. I matured at a very like young age in my life and I've gotten it from so many people to the point where they was like, you know, for you to be this age, you know, you seem very wise and very mature and you know a lot. And I'd be like, well, thank you. I really appreciate that because you know, you, you don't come off as like this childish person or whatever, like you're, you're very like, grounded and on top of that you're very humble like you a lot of things do not excite you like they can have the most money they can dress or that but that stuff don't excite you you might get expensive things here and there but at the same time you know you are very humble about everything you do like and this is why people don't believe you change because see, you are doing things that makes you happy now. You are focusing on you and it's, it's, it's benefiting you because you are no longer putting the focus back on other people, my friend. And this is why they are upset about the whole situation, okay? They don't believe you changed because my friend, they haven't changed. One bit. Peace. You see, my friend, my friend, they don't believe you changed because see, when they see you, they still might see you as the old you. They haven't fully awakened to the new you yet. And see, this is why you have to remove yourself from around a lot of people because God will put you in a, a place by yourself in order for him to work on you. So when you step out and when God is ready to show you and reveal you, people are gonna be like, wow, like you look different. You see, my friend, my friend, they don't believe you changed because, see, a lot of people have triggered your emotions, you know, have pressed buttons, and they literally, really have provoked you to anger, okay? And they wanted to see that ugly side of you. But, you see, your whole entire life, you have literally been a sweet person. You have been literally sweet. You are respectful, you know, um, you just are a family person. You love getting along. You love laughing. You are like the, you may even be the one that's very funny. Like you love to make others laugh. And like you got a very goofy side to you. And me too, like you, you just love having fun. But a lot of people have tried to bring that ugliness out of you. Just so they can just be like, hi, you know, like, I see, you know, you're not so perfect after all, but you've never tried to be. People try to already, like, when they see you, they try to already put you in a box or frame you as if, oh, you're just so good to be true. They're already trying to put you in this light, not even knowing you. They're just going based off first impression or how you act, how you talk, how you speak. But... God has made changes within you, my friend, and you are literally working on yourself. Believe it or not, you are slowly doing the work. Even if you don't see it right now, trust me, 
you're going to see it within a couple of days. Whatever you're doing, my friend, keep doing it because it shall come to pass, okay? It's coming, okay? And it takes time. Nothing was meant to happen overnight, but it's happening for you, my friend.